Thank you, Jesus. Keep forgetting to turn that microphone on, y'all. Lord have mercy. How many videos have I recorded without the mic on? Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Life of Me. I'm back with another video. And, y'all, this video is going to be a little something different for my channel. I am on a no-buy, which I will get into. So I wanted to do, you know, you've seen plenty of videos on YouTube about anti-hauls or and will I buy it. So I wanted to put my little spin on it, uh, giving credit to everyone who's ever done it before. This is not my idea. This is not my idea, but I just thought it will be something fun for me to do on my channel because I want to be on the no-buy and I think it will help me because I can still look at the makeup and then I can analyze, you know, I could really analyze if I need it or not. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to see the video, just keep on watching. Okay, y'all, real quick before... I get started, depending on when this goes up, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to you and yours. I hope you have or had a wonderful Thanksgiving with your family because that's truly what it's about, being thankful and grateful for the things you have. And I'm grateful for you. Y'all, hey, y'all know I'm supposed to be on nobody this November. Okay, I, I did break it. Yeah, I did. I, I did. I, I did break it, but um, that's not what this video is about. But I just want to be out front and let you know that uh, I did buy something. Things. Some things. But that's another video. But for this video, since it's no by November, that's what this video is about. But before we go any further, I want to thank you all for clicking on this video to watch it. You're the real MVP, okay? But if you're new here and you have not subscribed, I personally think you should subscribe. I do all types of videos. I do hair videos, natural hair. I do makeup, I do beauty, I do hauls, I do life videos. And I try to do them with a sense of humor. So if you like to have fun, this is a channel for you. Okay, now on to what this video is really about. So, this is my take on the anti-haul realm. You know, on Instagram, Instagram will have you buying so much makeup. So, a lot of these things I have seen on Instagram, like on Trend Mood, Do That, Makeup, Crazy Makeup, you know, all types of sites. And I'll put them... Mm -mm, I won't. Well, I'm just doing this this initial video to see if you like this video. So if you like this type of video, please give me a thumbs up so I will know, okay? First, we're gonna talk about the unmentionables. There are some makeup brands or types that I just will not buy. And just so you won't, so you will know what they are, so you won't ask about them or wonder about them, I'll just do a little clip here because no, I'm not gonna buy these. Mm-mm. No boo. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Child, please. No. Okay, now on to the makeup. Now, the first thing that I noticed was a Sephora brand. Sephora Pro, you know, Sephora came, has all those eyeshadow palettes. They're, they're really good eyeshadow palettes. Well, they have come out with a... Two six quad eyeshadow palettes. They're Sephora Pros. One is called Whimsical and one is called Warm Matte. And they are supposed to be available on Sephora November 19th. So they should already be available. So I'll insert the price here. But as for me, these uh there are some pretty colors, but I don't need to buy this. For one, I already got these colors in so many things. And um, but I think this this would be a good purchase, depending on how much the price is, for someone who has not bought those larger pro palettes, because those have at least 36 colors in them. So if you have you do not have those, maybe you'll buy these, but for me, I will not be purchasing them. 
Okay, moving on. Next thing is Dose of Colors. They came out with a Mickey Mouse 90th Anniversary uh, collection. And this collection includes a eyeshadow palette that looks like it has a highlighter in it. So it has six eyeshadows and it looks like a highlighter. Three lip glosses and it looks like three lipsticks. Now, the lip glosses and the lipsticks get a real easy no from me. But y'all, that eyeshadow palette, I would get that eyeshadow palette. But seemed like it was already sold out before it even hit the release date. So... That might be a moot point for me. The eyeshadow palette is $39. The lipsticks are $17. And the lip glosses are $17. But if I bought anything from this, which I did want, it was that eyeshadow palette. You know, it's already really on Dose of Colors and sold out. And the lipsticks are already on Ulta. So the eyeshadow palette is obviously already sold out. So I'm like, why... This is a waste. Okay, the next eyeshadow palette is Melt Cosmetics. Their holiday palette is marijuana themed. That is not nothing I want in my collection. I don't even like any of these colors. I my favorite color is green, but this mm -mm, this is not nothing I want to say. Oh, I got the marijuana palette. No, thank you. Okay, the last eyeshadow palette I am not getting is the Morphe and James Charles eyeshadow palette. I feel like I already have these colors. One. Two, the bottom row, I don't even wear bright pastel -y colors, so what I'm going to do with that. And plus, this palette is huge. It, it, I, it might be a store in Nightmare too. What's it? The Matt Patrick Star Holiday release. It comes with the, his powder that everybody raves about, two eyeshadow palettes, three lipsticks, some glitters, and look like some colored liners. Um, and a highlighter. Now, I was interested in that... Um, highlighter or mineralized skin finish but then I read it was just a bunch of glitter so um I won't be getting that the eyeshadow palettes don't look like anything special I can't even wear black eyeliner so and glitter forget about it <laughs> so yeah I won't be getting it I'm not even the powder I don't like matte powders anyway so that will be a waste Oh, my money. So, no, nope, I won't be getting that. Something I would like to try is by e.l.f. e.l.f. has come up with a jelly highlighter. You know, for Farsali has one. May, I think it's Makeup Revolution has one that I have. So, I would like to try the e.l.f. one because I, ha I just bought an e.l.f. highlighter and I really like it. So, I would like to try the e.l.f jelly highlighter it was released on november 20th i think everything i'm talking about is already released um and you can get at elf and ulta let's see and does it have the price i don't know how much it's gonna cost but it's elf so it can't be you know that much now the last things i have are skincare first thing is olay Oil of Olay came out with a face mist. One is energizing and one is calming. Uh, the energizing one has vitamin C and the calming one uh, has aloe and chamomile. I would love to try these. So I will be picking these up. So I think these are good purchases actually. Another uh, skincare item I would like to try, at least one of them, is Makeup Revolution. They came out with three glow setting sprays glow setting sprays they're fifteen dollars each so they look like they may mimic uh or be something similar maybe to mac fix plus i don't know but i will at least try one of these so i think that's good because y'all know i love face sprays well, y'all, that's it for the makeup that I was looking at in the month of November and wondering, should I buy it or should I not? If you like this video and want to see more like it for corresponding months, give this video a thumbs up so I know that you like it. Thank you all so much for watching. Happy Thanksgiving, and I will see you in another video.